how's it going? Okay, so I see um, lots of stories in the news now are um, involving the military age um, migrants, military age men, blah, fighting men, blah, blah, blah. And America maybe are, are bringing them into their army and... Well, as far as I understand, uh, you've been able to join America, not like they're doing if they're doing that, but you could have joined there a long time ago as your path to citizenship. I think now it's just like straight up recruiting they're trying to make it look like. Um, this is not news. This was a thing like four, five, year, six years ago. Uh, the, whole, the whole term military age fighting men was when all those cowards were running into uh, into Europe. Remember? 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 Like, even the, you know, movies and books are all recycled. Now even the news is recycled. So, um, here in Canada, too, around that same time, they were, when they were uh, letting Syrians, Syrian refugees come here, um, they were saying something like that. Well, maybe we could let them join the military. And what did I and others say? Well, if that ever happens, it's certainly not going to be to fight in an, a, a conflict somewhere. It's going to be to... Uh, to, to use against us because, well, there, remember people say, well, I can't see our own army being used against us. That's right. But they'll use people like this against you and they all come from grapey countries. What do you think? They're going to uh, train them, arm them, and send them back to where they came from as Americans? Really? You're going to see lots of uh, theories about this, uh, you know? Yeah, they're just sending them to do the fighting. Well, then those guys are really stupid if they think that they're getting anything by coming here. They ran away from a war because they're cowards to come here to America to send them back to war. <laughs> there you go. Uh, all I could say is if they send them to the Middle East, watch out, uh, women. Watch out, Israeli women. Watch out, any women. Now these they won't. These guys will be like uh, America's grapey army. Right on, eh? They can uh, pal out with the Canadian one. Still waiting for the first time a grooming house is discovered here in Canada. Like, that, where the public actually it comes out in public. Don't tell me there isn't one. I'm, I'm damn, I'm convinced. You'll never convince me there isn't. Especially in Toronto. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, all that stuff.